went back in deep ocean. Oh my word. Of course, it would be right in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> hey, there's a pole over there. Um, deep, lukewarm, warm ocean. Okay. An actual monument, or is it just a thing? Wow, this is a lot more expansive than I thought. Hell yeah. Uh, actually, let me check out over here. Whoa! <laughs> Look at this place! Island here. Okay, one thing I want to experiment with. Um, I don't know how true this is, that's why I don't want to experiment. Oh, this is the fortune one. This is cool. Okay. We found a warm ocean. Quest complete. <laughs> now, I want to set up a base here. Nothing too fancy. Some over there. Ah, oh, lovely. base for the quarrel, but <laughs> uh, Windsep swept savannah, uh-huh. Thought it would be like extreme Seen this? Mangrove. Oh. Mud. Oh, hell yeah! It definitely feels like we've been followed when we're in here. <laughs> I will admit. Uh, oh, you know what would have been a good way of traveling as well? Would have been an Electra? Don't really use them. Come on, there we go. 
I haven't really used it too often. Get that and some fireworks. This is cool. Uh, I've always loved these like extreme hills. See, now, now I want to make, like, two bases. <laughs> one would be up at the top, and one would be down at the bottom. And try and link it up so then you, you go... Oh, that's deep. That is deep. Yep. Deep. When you come in, you go at the top and you have to dive down each time. <laughs> Speaking of deep, I do need to find oh, my boat, for one. Uh, I do need to find lava to make a portal. I like it's like, oh yeah, this will be a short uh, stream or whatever, yada yada yada. No, this has already been split up into two, probably. Especially with me trying to then make my way back. Alright, we could always move the portals and stuff later. So I'm just heading over to this beach. How would... Hmm. Is that another temple over there? Is that a temple? I mean, it's something. I thought that was a tree under the water there. No, it's just the way the dirt formed. Played a trick on my dumb eyes. I thought it might have been. It's a village. This place is really cool. <laughs> oh, wow! <laughs> Oh man, this place is awesome. That camel? Are there camels in this game? <laughs> There's a derpy face. Oh, you are awesome. Hello. Alright, let's bed uh, so we don't cause trouble for these guys. I hope that camel stays about. Oh, I thought he was a aggressive then. I hope these guys have enough survivability for them. And there is a golem, but he's like trapped back here. Let me just... I'm trying to help. Oh. 
Basically, I, I want to make it then the golem has an easier way to get from back there to the rest of the town. This place is cool. And I don't know if golems have enough height clearance for three. How do I check this out? There's a camel here. I didn't know camels were a thing. Y you. Are you a cane water camel? He seems to be having fun. Oh my gosh, I love the camel. <laughs> if there's one thing we're taking from this place, it might be that camel. Um, right, so. We got our bed. We need to make our way down to lava. We need... Last furnace. Ah. Huh. Ah, oh, hello. Ooh. Some terracotta. This place is cool. They even have food for us. <laughs> um. I'm trying to think what would be the best place to dig down. Honestly, it might be better to just like head inland a bit. And then see if there's just like a hole that we can like dive, maybe not dive. Wouldn't want to go into an underwater hole. There's light here for some reason. Oh, I hate this. Things I hate, this. <coughs> this isn't too bad, weirdly enough. I think it's because it's like somewhat enclosed and I have a decent breath gauge <laughs> and an easy way of making more air, for example. Air has been made. block. Some glow squid. I think we're back at the warm ocean, just because of the colour change. It's just a... Make a quick hidey hole. I would never have done this if I didn't have the uh, Aspiration 3 helmet. I never realized how much of a difference it made.
It, it sounds like there's something behind us. <laughs> oh my word. <laughs> that was very trippy. Not gonna lie, if we find a geode here, <laughs> not Mesa's gonna have some competition, I'll tell you. I mean, it already does. <laughs> I mean, there's nothing stopping us from making like, two laps. That was badly done. That was a miss. Right, we came down here looking for lava. But now we're just down here, exploring this massive ass cave. That was just a big old mess. Oh, we found lava. Not gonna lie. Kind of disappointed that we found lava. <laughs> Whoa, we missed this hole. I'm surprised he missed us. <laughs> we need. <sighs> we don't have a flint and steel, so we need to get iron. Which, once again, isn't a big deal, but still. You'd think I would, you know, be better prepared by now. I'm also all this stuff is in an ender chest. Not obsidian. Thinking about it. Oh, is it? I don't know. I need to sort out my ender chest better. Whoops.
and grab enough obsidian for a portal and a ender chest. Don't know if that's enough, but we'll grab a little bit more. Uh, eight, and then there's sixteen. Yeah, that's more than enough. exciting <laughs> it's like we've hit one dead end why well, I don't know why I was you know thinking that second time <laughs> Hmm, surely this didn't, uh, this went this way the first time. Surely it won't do the same thing a second time. Oh, damn. <laughs> that was so bad. I'm so glad I've got good armor. And plenty of food. One thing I have to remind myself is these caves aren't, like, super rare. So, it's not like, it's not like the one we have at, um, not Mesa. Could, like that one might be better. There's a mine shaft there and everything, and at least one geode. <laughs> the nice thing about having a lot of shulker boxes this time around, as opposed to just the one. I don't have to worry too much about organization. <laughs> so I, I've got plenty of room. Um, let's get out of here. And the, the main thing that this one has going for it is just because of its location above. I, I really like its location. So I'm like all four staying in this area. I did this a really dumb way. Really bad. That's what I get for trying to rush and be cool. Like the thing I've realized with, um, what do you call them? 
the geodes is that their outer shell isn't the I can't remember what's called now. The white blocks. It's actually like basalt first, then the white. It's a very odd looking floor. Just with just due to how flat it is. So it's like the main reason why I want to check it out, but it's like but, I don't know why he made me jump so much. <laughs> There's something about it being a flat end like this. Honestly, the one thing that really could have like sealed the deal for this place, well, there are two things that could have sealed the deal. One would have been, either one would have worked. I guess Geode as well. Hmm. Um, but the lush underground area, that would have been cool. Uh, or slash and the... I don't know what you call it, the corrupt area. I don't really feel like tackling that now anyways. But something we're gonna have to find. That bat secret serviced itself for that creeper. Unluckily for the bat, I had more arrows. gold at the end of the tunnel. <sighs> yeah, this is really neat. This one's really neat, but sadly, I don't think it's I haven't checked it fully yet, of course. That was a short fuse. I'm just <laughs> doing such a bad job. Um, yeah, sadly, question mark? I... I I think I like oh. it's slightly more, but I, I don't think it's going to be enough to make me pick it over. Not Mesa. Valiant effort, though. Oh, this is what <laughs> yeah, it really always feels like there's something behind you. 
this and we're assuming uh, Mike next, but you know what, let's just focus on getting back up. I know I could literally do just dig straight up. But we would have missed these diamonds. Is this like a ceiling? It is like a ceiling. So glad there's no like large scale just loop. large scale underwater beast. Um, I do still need iron. I, I'm still unsure whether or not I want to make a iron farm or not. I mean, part of me does like the idea of not. That's really dumb out of me. Because then, once again, it gives iron more value when we go caving. But there's a lot of fun things you could do with loads of iron, like just make a real carts everywhere. Oh, that looks like a dead end. Yeah, thankfully, drowned aren't too hard to avoid in water. I'm going to ignore picking up stuff right now so I can try and get out yeah oh wow <laughs> made quite the distance I'm really happy with this find though Ooh, excuse me. <laughs> Check it out. Even has a floating island. <laughs> That's where we should build our house. <laughs> the worst thing is, now that I've said that out loud and laughed at it, the, the thought of it is actually sinking in. It's like, oh, that would be kind of cool. But I feel like I wouldn't want to. Honestly, if anything, right now my my thought is maybe making a house like in the village. Oh, check out this little cave. Eat. Yeah. Well, I think this is going to be it for... Oh, we still need to sort out the leather side. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> um, where would be a appropriate place to put this portal? But first, let me just... Put the wrong thing down. Uh, free up some room. And we did get a... Thing. So, hold on, let me. Of course. Is this a fortune? Yeah. There we go. Um. I mean, once again, we could always take uh, huh. I that we don't need these. Huh. Always take the portal down. But I'm going to... We don't have much... Oh, 
before we go into the nether. I'm gonna do it over here, just because it's out of the way and it's not disruptive. To everything. Um cool, cool, cool. That one. Did I not pick up any coal? No, we did pick up coal at the start of this journey. There we go. That could be enough. Stacks. Oh, that that should do. Um, let me one, two, one, two, three, one, two, one, one, two, three. Thankfully, we do have a good pick. <laughs> so that mistake is not going to cost us ten minutes. Um, I know I put wood somewhere. Was it's not in oh there it was. Uh almost Did I Keep forgetting my maths. Um we probably would need some blocks. On the ready. I guess I'll have this stone just in case. The smart thing to do would be not just leave the shulker boxes here. Oh, actually. <laughs> just wanted an easy way to find this coordinates. <laughs> Join in world. Okay. So, this one. Uh, one thing I always struggle with in the nether, and I've said this before, and I'll probably continue to say it, is I really struggle with depth in the nether. Yeah, it's one reason why I like getting an XP farm now, though, to be fair. It means I can repair my stuff relatively easily. I don't know why I didn't just use a block, but hey ho. I'm an idiot. <laughs> no. F.
We'll have a quick look around. Because that hasn't bit me in the ass before in another. <laughs> oh. We, we would have been... We would have been fine, but I would have... You know, swore. <laughs> and not been happy about it. Still need to go back and potentially finish that bastion we found. I say potentially, because I still don't know if there's anything else for us to actually do there. Oh well. This is very satisfying when you get into the rhythm. Um. as possible, or double deep. Right now we're lucky there are no gas, but you know, it's Minecraft, it's the nether. And you know, Thankfully, these blocks are blocks that we have a lot of. There's another fortress then. No, it's just the sh way the shadows in the tree work. <laughs> okay, this this I'm not too worried about double bracket, because there's an actual bottom to it. I feel like this forest is the one that keeps confusing me. I really was about to say this with the domes, like, okay, well, let's get rid of the woods, so then the leaves will despawn. This is obviously going to be another area that we'll have to tidy up. I just realized, no, we're on the opposite side of the nether, aren't we? 
I'm still a ways to go. Jeez. The smart thing, 100%, would be to not go this way and just continue to dig our tunnel. That's just, when have I ever been smart? Because the tunnel will be a straight shot. Although low-key part of me also wants to like explore the nether. We might find something new and useful. And I know we're going round the long way, but once again, we don't have to tunnel right now. Dang it. We have to tunnel right now. <laughs> Alright, on that case let's back up. I could dream. Right, right now, supplies are good. Uh, inventory is good. Yeah, I'll back up a bit more so we're more accurate on the right level coordinate. Quick food break. <laughs> I can already see myself falling that way. If anyone despawned. <laughs> um, so what, it's the one annoying thing about the Nether at times is just like traversing it. Be annoying just in terms of oh wait another pool of lava or another cliff or another way that kind of just needs to dig through. situations like this is like oh great I don't really want to be doing this here I'd rather have this be lined up with the other location so with that in mind I might just be a bit more the lase and just go um One thick. Which isn't that big of a deal. Like, initially, if we fall, I think we have a decent chance of getting back to the surface. The, the hardest thing will be if we fall is keeping myself orientated and being able to get out quickly. Uh, one thing I guess we could do if we were really worried about our stuff is to place the shulker boxes down so they don't burn. Right, I think you could put them down in lava fine. Just then we'll have to figure out a way to retrieve them, but that is 
not a big deal because we could <laughs> we could do that would arguably kind of be kind of like a funnish mission I thought I saw someone standing next to the bones. I did. It was a skeleton. It's appropriate. Certainly no signs of, like, a fortress. Which would have been nice. Um, I guess the easiest way is just to... Uh, maybe over. I need to glance down. You need to back off. <laughs> Occasionally. I'm doing that just in case it does just open up underneath us. Oh, I really hate that one. <laughs> yeah. It'll be a fun dig back next time. And the worst thing about doing this this way. Like just the one thick. Is that it makes it harder to deal with if you have sudden lava. Bam, I thought I was going to do more damage to it, not going to lie. Um, we're not far off. I don't know if this is our biome, but... And by that I mean this one is the same one. Or if it's just like another biome and then there's a split between. That makes sense. Uh... This is... Army does wonders, like, would it be easier to just, like, go down to lava level and then bridge there? You'd probably have a bit more consistency, but... At the same time, we'll have to deal with, you know, mountains you come across and whatnot. Recognizing anything. I mean, we're still. Where are we? 300 odd blocks away. Oh, right. This is so sun, so it's like indebted slightly. This is gonna suck. <laughs> one way. One reason why I'm okay with doing this one wide 
is we're going to have to redo this with a better material regardless. So let's just get over. And then we can make it safer at a later point. Because one thing I need to do, I need to just like take a look and see the mechanics of coal and see how would they how it plays out. By that I mean I like can we grow more? Is it limited? Um, what needs to be placed on? All that good stuff. I don't. I I want to stop and like take a quick look around, but I kind of don't as well because the longer we're on here, the longer chance we have of a gas showing up and being a bit of a dick. Um, not seeing anything. Safer, but it's a bit safer. <laughs> and now we're like stuck up here. There's like, it looks like it's easier to travel down there, but it won't be down here. Hoping to like round the corner and see something I recognize. Your distance is not the greatest. Stupid fog. I'm just floating. <laughs> not gonna lie, I also had the like the. It's not. Shame. I had the other thought of like. Almost looks like it should be a boss. Or like, um, I can't remember what they're called now. The Sphere Dudes in uh, XCOM. Oh, you poo. Can't you see him eating? Ow. Like accidentally making it harder for us to place it in the right spot by also breaking blocks that would help remove it. Back to work. <laughs> Food. Yeah. Oh. 
recognize this place. Alright, we did make a bridge over here. Alright, and this does lead... I want to say this leads towards... This safer. That's the village portal, right? That way. <laughs> oh, there's another wart farm here. Um, let me dump. Those quickly. Uh, one of the torches. I want to say this leads to a fortress. I'll say, oh hello. Um, let's just switch back to this for now. Just rediscovering places from our old adventures. Oh, my. Annoyed at how unsafe this is. <laughs> Just scared someone's gonna drop down on me and knock me off. It's a bit safer. this biome and then forest I should say and then eventually Fortress. How do we get up there? Holy cow. Um, we need to get up there quickly. <laughs> We have no blocks right now. <sighs> Speaking of, if we're going to go up there, we probably need blocks. <laughs> uh, I want to say I've explored this fortress, so... Oh, here we go. path to it. Well, there's an ender chest here and everything. Skeletons. 
Um, this should be safer. of fighting these guys. Ah, that's what's making the noise. Right, so. I'm back at the fortress. We've got stuff to kill, to murderize, to get their skulls. Looks like it's an actually decent location for them to spawn in. Because it looks like there's a lot of intersections, and I want to say intersections are like the best place for spawns. And it's also like, there's not much in terms of other land mass for other things to show up. It's a shame that uh, bows can't have loot in. <laughs> I mean, you can, you can give them loot in, but it doesn't actually have an effect. Like, you have to actually hit them with the bow. Okay. Well, I'll deal with this later. I might go back to base space. Get some materials to help make this place better. Or maybe I won't. I don't know. Well, I, I will want to at some point, because we'll want a lot of skeleton heads. Because I want a lot of beacons. So we need to kill the wither a lot. So that's a lot of things we need to do. <laughs> I was going to say some dub there. I was like, oh, we could put a portal here. That's not going to help anything. Either way, thank you all for watching, and I'll catch you next time where... I don't know. I really don't know what we'll be doing next, stream-wise, but uh, there's a few things I can do off-camera at least. There's a plenty of things to do off-camera, so at least maybe some of them might be done, potentially. <laughs> Anyways, catch you all next time. Bye-bye. Enjoy the speed-ups.